What's going on, everybody? This is Super Robot Ed, and today we have in front of you for Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, I mean, huh, Transformers Missing Link, Sunstreaker, and Cordon First Stock Images. So as you know, if you are familiar with G1 and the subsequent reissues throughout the years, one of the characters that were not reissued officially was Sunstreaker. And a lot of people have been picking up these Sunstreakers and selling them on eBay loose because they're basically reverse engineered KOs. There was a fire that happened and there were a lot of figures that lost. Apparently Hasbro had molds, supposedly, or Takara. I don't remember exactly. And I'm sure the Captain Obvious was, will chime in. But basically, the Dinobots, Sunstreaker, Mirage um, is like a host of other figures that their molds, molds, were destroyed and unfortunately no one you know hasbro nor takara wanted to reverse engineer and any of these to make reissues for them but now with missing link we're getting these and now there's a question that i have here and real quick we spin out man now y'all know the story that actually sunstreaker was supposed to be red and sideswipe was supposed to be yellow so when you see the red Sunstreaker, that's actually what it's supposed to be him. And if you see the yellow uh, Sideswipe, that was supposed to be what he looked like. But the colors got reversed. And I guess they're going to save uh, Spin Out because that's the name they're giving him based on Masterpiece. I'll just call him Red Sunstreaker 4. Hmm. Would it be nice if they do a Sideswipe missing link? That would be cool. And of course, here's first picture is Cordon. He's the police car version of the modified Countach Lamborghini, of course. Um, I do have both him and spin out in the uh, selects two pack. And of course, here's Sunstreaker, the one that people have seen and the pictures we have seen in the prototype and the videos that I posted before. Um, overall, Missing Link is a hit. I think a lot of people like it. I am very indifferent when it comes to Missing Link only because I prefer what we're getting with the new War for Cybertron Legacy figures because of the fact that they actually look more like a cartoon. But... For a lot of people getting this G1 figure that can that was art that can articulate itself better than the originals did. I mean, that's a lot. You know, the only one I really want is Optimus Prime because he's the most iconic, and I stopped there because honestly, I still think my legacy five-pack Sunstreaker looks far better than Missing Link. But the fact that we can make this toy, G1 brick toy, have articulation, it's a good thing. And also for the fact that Sunstreaker is being officially released again. And with more articulation, I think that's going to be a great selling point. Now, will this be a two-pack? I doubt it. The price of some of these toys are fairly expensive in the sense of what they are. But at the same time, I'm sure people are going to buy these because, as you know, Cordon is basically Diaclone, as well as the Red Sun Streaker. So we'll keep our eyes and ears open for anything new. But other than that, this is a very good promising sign for more things to come. And what are your thoughts? Leave them down in the comments below. Of course, if you want this, let me know. If you don't want this, let me know. But of course, as my name is Super Robot Ed. Please like, subscribe, and share. Bring more news reviews, and then we'll see you soon. I'm going to go get some plates. Bye-bye.